and really what you're looking for is how does Lance look physically? Because again, he's coming back from a fairly devastating injury. Mm -hmm. And so he looks incredible. You know, he looks like he's in incredible shape. His, he was not moving gingerly from anything that, that has been posted uh, recently. He's taken full dropbacks, all of those things, right? It was a, it was the right ankle that he broke. That's his, that's his, uh, you know, that's his rear leg on his drop. And that's the, where all the weight goes at the, at the top of the drop. And he wasn't, he looked fine. That's huge. And that's, that's really all that you can expect right now. And, and again, for anybody listening, like buckle in, take a breath, do whatever you need to do. This is not going to end until the season starts in terms of what this Mm -hmm. quarterback competition looks like. And Please don't lose your mind reading into the tea leaves uh, of OTAs and and training camp and anything like that, right? Because you're going to drive yourself nuts. Um, this is going to play out. Kyle Shanahan's going to let it play out. And like you said, depending upon how Brock looks as he throws, this could end up being a competition between, between the three of them. But ultimately, you know, it is it is Purdy's job to lose. And, and Lance even said that, you know, Matt Mayoko asked him a question after OTAs today about uh, Lynch and Shanahan's comments in March about basically Brock Purdy being the leader in the clubhouse. And Lance said the same thing that he said back in March when 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 it came out. And that was Brock absolutely deserves to to have that to have that designation. You can't take anything away from what he did last season. And the only thing that Lance the only expectation that he has is Lance said the only expectation he has is to uh, get an opportunity to compete. And that's what he's going to do. And, you know, kudos to kudos to Lance, right? It's year three. You're not getting handed anything. And if you can't beat out Sam Darnold, then, then, then you got bigger issues, right? So, mm-hmm. Hey, may the best man win. And I absolutely hope that is Trey Lance. And, and I think it will be. 